everybody, Dan Ninemeyer, All-American Baseball. Uh, founder of All-American Baseball, I've been here. It's our 16th year training young players and super excited about some of the things that we've got going on. Hi, I'm John Bondi. I'm the uh, general manager of the All-American Fieldhouse. I'm also the infield and outfield instructor. Um, I coach the 11U red team and the 15U red team. What's up everybody? My name is Mike Pearson. I am the director of Team All-American and I'm also the pitching coordinator for all of our players here. Um, I'm the coach of the 12U blue team as well as the 16U red team and this will be my sixth season. What's up? I'm Mason Bame. I played at All-American since I was 10 years old. Uh, this fall I'll be going to Penn State Greater Allegheny. Um, past summer and as well as this summer I've had the fortune of coaching the 12, 13 year old group um, which is a lot of fun. It's a lot to uh, it's a lot of information to pass on. You know, years ago I used to always tell our, our families and our players that we would be incredibly blessed to have them all back here um, and be a part of our mentor program, but also be a part of our coaching staff. And, you know, with where we have in the facility that we have, it's, a, it's really been quite a, a unique experience to have a lot of our former players back as coaches and a part of our program, but also the players that are in college and our pro guys that are back here and mentoring our young players and our younger players. Uh, it's, it's a really cool and a unique uh, atmosphere that's been created here. We're, we're very proud of it. Hello, my name is uh, Connor Perry and I play for the Detroit Tiger organization. You know, it's always a good time to come back and you know, give back to the younger guys here at All-American. Um, just coming back in this atmosphere and seeing Coach Nine get uh, get into these guys and just holding them very accountable. Uh, it's just you know a really cool thing to see and brings me back to a lot of memories. Um, but you know giving back to these kids and helping them out and you know try to tell them something that I wish I knew back in the day. Uh, it's just a really cool experience for everyone involved. And I love coming back here, training back here, and you know not only making them better but you know they make me better. Uh, Coach Nine has helped me along the way, so the best I can do is you know come back and be with these guys, especially in this great new facility that we have, which is awesome. I'm super excited to see. So from a facility standpoint, I think again, it's a really unique space. Um, we had been here years ago, you know, as a tenant. Uh, now being a partner and, and an owner in this space is something that's pretty unique for us. As far as where we're heading with things, uh, we have all of our netting has kind of come into the facility now, so we'll be entering and putting up nets on the sides and the ceilings so that we can go live with our guys at some point. We won't, we won't try and push the envelope on live until probably the start of middle of February once our pitchers have been pushing a little bit. We'll have all of our cages come in. We're looking at 175 footer, 550 footers. We'll have our throwing lanes set up for our pitchers. Got to take good care of those guys apparently according to Coach Pearson. Uh, but they've got a lot of plyo walls on the rev soda. They'll have everything that they need. And then uh, one thing I'm very, very excited about is the position player only plyo wall which we'll be designing specifically for our space over here, for our catcher space. Um, and that's also exciting too, where in the past we'd always kind of had our catchers in a smaller area that, you know, we'd set up a machine, it would be their area just for, for those guys. But now we have this exclusive area, which is 25 foot wide. We can elevate some, some hack attacks and really pound the zone for them to work on the receiving and footwork uh, and tie that special plyo wall, which I'm super excited about for our guys. And then the other side of this that we're working on, kind of a work in progress is we've got a mobility area set up here for our guys to really work on their ankle and hip mobility for our catchers and position players and then the opportunities for us to add the, the weight room are, are incredibly exciting as well. So it's really exciting for us this winter uh, to have our new facility and to have the space um, and the ability to do what we want, when we want, how we want with our players is something uh, that I think is very unique um, and not a lot of players have the opportunity to be able to train the way our guys will this winter. Just having all this space here, you know, multiple infields, you know, batting cages coming in, mounts, everything, it, it, you know, it means the world. We can have, you know, 200 kids here working at once compared to, you know, just 30 kids on a baseball field. So just this, this place here, having it, is, you know, we're very fortunate.